are you huddled in front of the TV again, girl? I don't get why she likes sitting in front of it. Good thing I've got two screens to work with when I do this. Okay, let's pull up the list real quick because I totally forgot to. I think it's Samus color. I thought I was already on it. <laughs> Straw pole. That is not what I clicked at all, you fucking machine. Thank you. That's what I was searching for. Great, we're at the boss fight. That's hilarious. Give me a second. Now remember folks, you can vote on this as much as you want. Let's see the results. We're currently at the next choice is Egyptian, yellow and blue. See, cloak color, yellow and blue. So, let's take out the green. There we go. Not that one, the bad form. I want to see how it looks like that. That looks awesome. I love it. Egyptian cotton. Oh, yeah. Now I remember. Wrong one. Yeah, okay. I was trying to see what I was equipped with. Come on. Come on. Go out, you blast the things. No! Damn it! I'm stuck up down here now. Ow. That's why I didn't want to touch one. I wish I had the poison fog by now. It's going to make this boss fight a thousand times easier. Oh well. Let's take on arguably one of the harder bosses in the first part of the game. Not really. I consider... I consider all rocks harder than the ham. Dang it. Great. Out of hearts. Yeah, if you want these bodies to stop flowing, get rid of the get rid of this first. This is where the demon film area comes your best friend. At least until you get the sword. Because he will take care of all the ones down below. Just gotta make sure none land behind you. Like those ones did. I wish I had more ammo! Let's 
see what items I got on me. Karma coin uses two effects. Shuriken. Monster Veil. Might as well. Yeah, it's a bit random on what will be summoned depending on how powerful the Monster Veil vale is. One use, forgot about that. Fuck it, let's try it. Okay, it works for enemies on the fucking ground. It's worthless. Let's see what other items I've got on me. Oh, why not? I'm not going to be using these potions on anyone else. I just realized I still got the Alucard armor on. No wonder I'm taking so much damage. Got him! I win! Yeah, I don't like using those potions too often because it makes the boss fight way too freaking easy. But yeah, once you pull your way to the core, it take doesn't take that much to kill him. As you just saw. Okay, there's usually just one here. What the, Where'd the extra one come from? Where is it? I know it's here somewhere. I just picked it up. Where is it? There you are. More drill. Longer reach than the ice brand. If I can hit something. Plus, compared to the ice sprint, it's a it's about the same attack. Yeah, it's pretty much your only reward for going down here. You don't have to fight Legion at all, really, unless it's for stage completion. I mean, map completion. That's pretty much the only reason you fight him. Yeah, they're fire elemental, so of course they're not going to do that much damage. Actually, let me work my way back up there. That hurt. That hurt more. I hate the fires. I hate them a lot. Save. Let's hope I get firebrand on my way out. Actually, yeah, I can switch off Holy Rod now that I've taken out mo and the biggest demon in the area. Yeah, that's the walk armor doing that all that up take of damage for me. It is 21 and it will keep increasing the more the map is open.
intelligence up. Or that one does even more. But it knocks down the fence. That one does 27. Either way. See how much on the. Uh, yep, I've got all the map here filled. I just gotta leave. And of course, get a few kills in for the beast air. So I ignored this guy earlier. I just realized I couldn't see the friggin' microphone volume. For a guy who can literally wield black holes, he is pathetic compared to his other armored brethren. Sirloin! But not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for Firebrand. Nope. No Firebrand. No Firebrand. Fuck. Usually I pick it up by now. Yeah, that's why he looks like you properly kill him. But yeah, kill that big skeleton guy enough times you'll get Thunderbrand. And it's by far one of the hardest rare items to get a pickup for. You're better just finding it. It's got the same link as the Mordred over here. Whatever, whatever this weapon's called. Ooh, fire. So yeah, we can pretty much leave once I find my way out of this place. Don't you toss me through the doorway, you asshole. Fuck. You are pathetic. So as you might have guessed, the more I mean the more grail, whatever it's called, works the same as the holy rod. Only difference is it's got a better reach overall. It's far more aggressive. Easier to whip out. Well, the Holy Rod's got a better reach, I mean, better outer reach, you know, like around you. This one's got a further reach to in front of you. And of course, it's got more attack. This is pretty much giving me your primary blade throughout the rest of the castle if you manage to get it as early as possible. Up until you get to the second half of the game, then everything goes out the window on weapon strength. This is going to take me a while. It might just be one whole part just trying to get out of this bloody place. Don't worry, we're almost to the teleport. Miss me. I thought I escaped. Okay, we're at the teleport finally. Which one should we take? I think we want to take, uh... Hmm. Yeah, let's take the... Take the horse. Because there's a few items that I missed picking up earlier. I can do that for the final... I mean, for... Yeah, the final section.
Horse, how hard is that? Thank you.